we're following some breaking news as this 12 p.m. broadcast news continues. The Interstate 95 is back up and running despite the fact that there was a crash that happened overnight. So with that being said, nobody was critically hurt or injured at the time. It all started when two men plus another victim was taken to a nearby hospital. I just can't believe it all happened way too fast like that. Philadelphia police released some new video of suspects. They say they are wanted with robbery and assault at a local train station. Back on December 12th, a 20-year-old young man jumped on the platform at 11th and Market Street. And we're being told that he is still remaining at large. And if you see him or the suspects in the video, just call police right away. A man was shot multiple times on North Broad Street on the 4700 block in Logan. That victim was found next to a car. Nobody is in police custody as of right now. Masks are being worn for many schools. CBS3 was there at the Masterman School in Spring Garden. You must wear one for the next days or so. As of right now, masks are no longer needed when going to a sporting event or anything else. The time right now is 12.07 p.m. on your Wednesday afternoon. We take you to Gerard College as everybody's getting ready for Martin Luther King Jr. Day. For those of you who know what the federal holiday is all about, it's all about a young man who has a dream, depending on what he might do in his life. National Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day, for those of you who have your calendars or want to get one, is on January 16th of this year. Much more ahead on CBS3, Outwardist News at Noon, the rest of the top stories, and everything else. We'll be right back. I shall return after this.